Hello, Divine Collective. Welcome or welcome back to my channel, Divine Goddess Enlightenment. I'm Ashley, and I am here with some cosmic gems for you guys. As you tap in, don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. Make yourself at home. Hit the bell so you can be notified every time I drop a read. I hope you guys are having a fabulous afternoon. I'm doing well. The link to my self-published poetry book, The Unpolished China, will be in the description as well as the About section. I would like to take this time out to thank all my new subscribers. Welcome. Thank you to my day ones. You guys have been nothing short of amazing, and I truly appreciate every single last one of you, your kind words, your generous donations, just your love, your being. It never goes unnoticed over here, my baby. So let's tap in. Let's tap into the vibes, okay? <laughs> I'm feeling so good, y'all. I feel so good today. So y'all could be in this energy too. It's just like you you have no worries. You, It's like... You have this inner knowing that everything you desire, everything God promised you, you have solid proof that it's manifesting. So it has you in this energy. You're unbothered. You're not worried. It's like you have no worries right now, okay? Uh, you could just feel this energy of bliss, okay? Just, you're just, you're, and I'm getting an energy of grateful. Someone here, I'm, I'm feeling like you're, you're, just grateful for everything because you know it's a major breakthrough manifesting for you. So start giving thanks now. I'm being guided to tell someone, okay? Don't forget to, to give thanks, okay? To your ancestors, your spirit team, to the creator, to mother, mother, I said mother nurture, <laughs> mother nature. You could be a water sign, okay? Um, and, you know, just being in this energy, of like being ready to receive all these great blessings that's been bestowed upon you, my baby. So let's tap in, y'all. But this is the download, y'all. God is using you to expose the frauds, expose the false prophets, okay? This is part of your soul contract as a divine one, as, uh, as this light worker. A part of your soul track is to expose all the frauds, to expose... Um, the imposters, if you will. <laughs> Y'all remember when Spirit Baby say say that word? Uh, with, I think this is what, like five readings ago or something. I was like, they're imposter. <laughs> so Spirit is just wanting you to like, it, it's like you're being used to is, expose the imposters because it's so many. And I remember it's like saying, like not only YouTube, but it's other platforms. And I'm getting just the world in general is oversaturated with frauds. Okay. It's very rare that you find someone that's that's truly their authentic self. Okay. Someone that's very that's very uh that's operating in their individuality, someone very pure, someone very rare. That real, that shit is rare, okay. And, you know, it's like you the clean up man. You the clean up woman. God sent you to, to, to escort these motherfuckers on about their business. Because it's a lot of individuals that can't seem to stay in their fucking lane. So that's when God called you to set, you know, set the tone. Set the vibes, if you will. Okay? <laughs> okay? Uh, I was also getting, like, these false prophets, they're attacking you because your authenticity. It, it makes them look like the frauds they are. Okay, when you put a clown next to a real one, I mean, it's got to be very obvious who, like, um, who's the authentic one. It's going to be very obvious. It's just like your, your authentic ex essence is making these motherfuckers look bad. And I also get, it's going to be a lot of individuals being called out for, uh, like, imitating you. That's going to be called out for little shit that like little, you know, like little side remarks. Motherfuckers be throwing shade but not, not being direct, okay? And I'm getting an energy. I always used to say this, bro. If it ain't directed, it ain't respected, okay? A, a real one, they going to be bold. They going to tell you what the fuck it is, okay? They not going to hide. They not going to throw a stone and hide their hand like a coward. They going to tell you the motherfucking vibes, Okay? So it's a lot of that shit going on. Motherfuckers, like, is there a lot of, you're going to witness and notice a lot of people getting called out for their bullshit. A lot of people getting called out for being fake. A lot of be people being called out for stealing others, other people's, their work, their, uh, their essence, their style, their swag, their demeanor, their intellect, their personality, all type of things, okay? 
Um, and I was also getting, um, it's like there these these are individuals too. These false prophets, these fake motherfuckers that's attacking you. It's like it's like they're threatened by by your power. And I was also getting it's a lot of motherfuckers that these false fake motherfuckers that intimidate, intimidate. Okay, uh, intimidate. <laughs> Imitate, my bad, y'all. My my mind is just every fucking where right now, bro. Okay, that these these individuals intimidate, uh, bro. Why am I saying what the fuck? Somebody somebody try to fuck with your mental, bro. Bro, these false motherfuckers, they been doing like they been trying that like, doing like confusion, like fucking with your throat chakra, okay? Because like I said, bro, you are powerful. Your words are powerful. You speak power. This threatened a lot of motherfuckers, okay? But I also was getting imitating, okay? These motherfuckers, you know, it's, it's a lot of people that's going to be called out for being fake. And these individuals that's threatened by your power, they're also uh, imitating who you are, imitating the gifts that the real gifts you possess, okay? Um, and this is like Spirit is saying, these are groupies, okay? You have a lot of groupies, okay? And these the type of motherfuckers. If you see them, in per like if they see you out, if if you see these individuals in person, uh, they would even they would freeze up in your presence. These are motherfuckers that'll sit behind the scenes in the shadows, or at least they think they in the shadows. Your ancestors always watching like a hawk, bro. Okay, so my fuckers can think they're in the shadows doing this weird shit and getting away with it. My fuckers got eyes in the back of their head. The real chosen ones know the motherfucking vibes. Uh, we're not activated. We don't have. We don't possess these powerful gifts for nothing. Okay, you. It's like they. These are the type of motherfuckers like I was saying, bro. They would if they was in your presence, they would freeze up. They're groupies. They're fans, bro. These motherfuckers are, they're literally your fans, okay? But they're so, they're so, like, what's the word I'm looking for? Lost. They're so lost in their own existence, their own, in, like, their own persona. You know, they would, they would, they would, it's like, these are unhealed individuals that would never tell you they're fans. These are like, like, like bro, you got real life goofy. I, I said goofies. <laughs> I was, I was trying to say groupy spirit said these, these groupies are goofy as fuck. Okay. It's like, uh, you have a lot of fans. Okay. This is fan behavior. I'm picking up. Okay. Like I said, God is using you to expose these, these frauds. Okay. To expose these fake prophets because it's too many. It's like they're oversaturating shit. And it's like YouTube and other platforms, the world. Bro, the world will push the goofies, uh, push the, the fakes, the frauds, the motherfuckers that ain't about shit to try to shadow ban the real. That's just, that's always been a vibes. And that's always been what has been in your own life and your own experiences you've noticed. Motherfuckers that ain't even fucking with you get pushed, yet you always knew you was the real deal. You was the real one. This was done intentionally to try to make you feel some type of way and try to shadow ban your greatness, okay? They can never shadow ban your greatness, all right? And that's the fucking vibes. Hold on, y'all. <laughs> Motherfuckers try to shadow ban your greatness, okay? But when you the sun, when you really appear light, when you really the star, you that shit gonna shine anyway, all right? Big facts big ones all right so let's tap into these vibes though this is a very interesting download i got okay the spirit just said god like want me to relay this message to y'all god is using you to expose the false, false prophets all right we gonna tap in they're getting called out as well okay motherfuckers look this on top of this deck first middle lash initial, initial k okay you may have receive some type of the someone's received some type some type of disturbing information about someone with first middle last initial k or this will happen this already happened okay so i'm i'm being guided to get some uh pull like just overall energy from the set so spirit eyes to the highest highlight it's not happening to this energy for my divine ones 
Look what just flipped over. As I'm saying my little prayer. I ask that you give me clear channel messages. I also ask that you protect me. As I open myself to different energies. Thank you, Ashe. Y'all see this? I, bro, didn't I just say? They try to shadow ban your greatness with all these frauds. All these fakes. All these motherfuckers. That ain't about shit, bro. And like I said, you are someone pure. You got pure divine white light. You gonna always outshine these motherfuckers without even trying here, okay? You bet you you you're you these motherfuckers got their panties panties in a bunch. You're causing a lot of frenzies around the universe simply with with simply by shining and outshining motherfuckers. You're not even trying to do this, bro. This is simply who you are, okay? God made you to shine, okay? And that's the fucking vibes here, all right? <laughs> Let's get some overall energy for my divine ones. I seen 10, 10 too when I was uh, preaching. <laughs> I said preaching. I ain't no damn preacher. I just speak the truth, my baby. I, I don't consider myself a preacher, a role. I mean, I guess I'm a, I'm a role model for the divine. I'm a role model as to how a real light worker, a real chosen one operate and like, and like heal and influence humanity in the proper way, okay? Because these false motherfuckers, bro, they're of the dark. They put on this facade, this persona. A lot of motherfuckers, they use words. They, Bro, it could be a motherfucker that sound very knowledgeable, very realistic. They sound like they're a master at this, they're a master at that. The, the, bro, words are magic. Any motherfucker could, could talk you out talk a motherfucker motherfuckers used to, that got the the gift of gab that got the gift of of like uh finessing with their words a motherfucker talk you they'll talk you out your fucking savings account literally these are the motherfuckers that that's the frauds that you gotta watch okay words and and how you relay certain messages with intention that's magic Words have a powerful influence on different individuals. And some motherfuckers that's frauds, that's that's grimy, that's snakes, they know that shit. These some grimy motherfuckers, okay? That you can't that's not to be trusted. Motherfuckers put motherfuckers under spells every day just by their, their lingo, their intellect, how they speak, their intention. It's the intention on when you speak. Big facts. So let's tap into the vibes of oh, what's this? 3D physical laws don't apply to you. Bro, it's the power for me. All right? Like I said, motherfuckers strained by your power. People, it's like these false prophets, they attack you. It's like, bro, these are, uh, that's what I get it. These motherfuckers are trying to test your gangster. They trying to test your power. Okay? They it, When a motherfucker tests you, they testing God. Okay? Motherfuckers be said back like, oh, uh, he or she, they, they, I bet they not this powerful. I bet if I do this spell, it, it'll affect them. They'll crumble. Okay. They'll, they'll fall off. This person, they just talking. They ain't this, they ain't that. And every time no bitches try, they just set the fuck down. Cause shit, they gonna know them fucking vibes. Whether they don't want to know this shit or not. All right. 3D physical laws on the plot of you. That's why my fuckers really don't like you, bro. Because they know you're truly chosen. People have witnessed when they try to send a text and evil eye and do shit, a motherfucker can't even speak your name without the universe topping on their ass. Okay, this is why people really don't like you. Because people really see the true, the true consequences and the true effect of what happens when they come for you, when they fuck with you. Motherfuckers don't like the fact. It's like people think you're just lucky. Like... You and you are, I wasn't really say lucky shit, you're favored. Mixed with a lot of luck. The the universe make everything happen for you, bro. You're favored. People see the magical shit that happens in your existence, okay? And they become they become greatly jealous of that because God made when you truly chosen, bro, motherfuckers gonna feel that shit. The motherfuckers gonna know the vibes without you even opening your mouth or anything like that. Okay, 3D physical laws on the plot of you, period. Motherfuckers don't like the fact too. You're pretty, you got a lot of galactic protection. All right, a lot of galactic protection here. You're truly tapped the fuck in here. It's what I'm saying. Okay. Um, I'm being guided to get some energy from this deck. What's the vibe spirit? But yeah, you're exposing the imposters. Okay, something significant about 2020. 
Bro. <laughs> They are where they royally fucked up. I'm telling you. These are these these frauds, these false prophets God has caused you to expose. Bro, I told you they, they've already attacked you. They've been trying to attack you. Okay, and they got set down. These motherfuckers are aware they royally fucked up. Okay, because they are aware you are true, you are true chosen one. Okay. And like I said, they're aware they really fucked up too, because a lot of people are starting to see the true them, see them for who they truly are. Okay. I'm getting some form of rejection. You rejected someone. You rejected someone's proposal, a business proposal, a offer. You rejected someone's friendship. It's a lot of motherfuckers mad they can't sit with you in this season. Okay, a lot of motherfuckers is attacking you off some type of rejection. You rejected someone's friendship, someone's business proposal, uh, someone's business contract, a relationship, some type of partnership you rejected. It's a lot of motherfuckers mad, bro. That it's that you don't. It's like you the type of motherfuckers that what a cup towards you. These groupies, these fans. It's like these are the type of motherfuckers that can't even sit with you, bro. It's a divine feminine I'm here. It's a feminine you rejected that, like, you rejected their friendship or some type of partnership. And this person started attacking you out of jealousy, okay? Because it's like this is the type of motherfucker you, you wouldn't even associate yourself with. Okay, you're a divine feminine. This person is very, they ain't got no type of class, no type of coof, okay? This is someone very trashy, very low grade, bro. This is someone very, it's like, they're classless. They're trashy. This is a type of motherfucker you don't even associate yourself with. Motherfuckers, yeah, motherfuckers is, yeah, I say rejection. Motherfuckers attacking you because offer some type of rejection. Rejection. That's someone specific. I'm picking up on a divine feminine. It's a trashy ass, a low budget ass bitch that you wouldn't even, that can't even sit with you. This, it's like, bro, motherfuckers really need to, uh, need to come down to reality. These motherfuckers know they already know they can't sit with you or they, they ain't on your level type shit, all right? They don't even vibrate on the same energy to even be in your presence. That's why I said this is the type of motherfucker that'll see you and freeze the fuck up because they're a fan, period. Ooh. Bank fraud. I, bro, <laughs> these are fucking frauds, bro, Okay. One of these apps, whoever this is, these, these fuck, bro, it's false prophets out here. They, they live in these luxury homes and drive these nice ass cars, but they all got it off of scamming. They all got it because they some fucking frauds. Okay. They all got it based off some, some, uh, unethical shit that, that they've done. And they trying to portray us. Oh, I'm blessed. God bless me with this. Oh, I'm favored. Bitch, you're a scammer. You're a fucking fraud. That's what the fuck you are. And a chosen one is being used to expose you. Okay? And it's uh, speak. And it's being divinely ordered. Okay? It's been divinely ordered. Like I said, bro, it's in your contract to expose the fuck shit. Because it's too much of the shit going on. All right? You're speaking on this. You're so well, bro. Like I be telling y'all, I be picking up all the energy. You so well, you, you speak on what other motherfuckers won't speak on or scared to speak on. You don't give a fuck. That's why, that's what a leader is. A leader, okay? Uh, so Someone that's here, here to lead the masses. A leader is someone who who's going to speak their mind, okay? Rather it hurts a motherfucker or not. As long as it's the truth, we all good. It's all there. Period. <laughs> People, the, it's like these false prophets, they hate the fact that you're truly authentic in what you do and you are truly chosen for the position. You ain't assert yourself in, in a, a fraudulent contract. You know what I'm saying? You were literally chosen to, to do what you're doing. And a lot of people hate you for that, bro. Because a lot of motherfuckers weren't chosen for shit, but to be a fucking fraud, but to be a karmic. A lot of motherfuckers was just chosen to be an example of what it looks like if you if if you really don't understand, okay? If you if you really if you you know you really not what the fuck you supposed to be. Somebody was born in May. May twenty twenty is highly significant. Whoo, baby. Hold on, y'all. I know you lying. This video was supposed to be uploaded. Hold on, y'all. 
uh, this other video. Okay. Okay, I got it. All right. Let's get some more energy. Let's get some more energy. Energy, energy. What's the vibe, spirit? Undefeated. You're the champ. Okay, you're undefeated. This is how these, these imposters look. They like, what have I done? Bro, they've done some shit. That really, that set they ass back for generations. They, like I said, these individuals are, they are aware they royally fucked up. Because whatever they've done, it, it didn't affect you in, in the way they thought that it would. I'm getting, okay. Someone, these, someone, bro, because you're high honor. Speak spirit. You're high honor here. Okay. These individuals, bro. It's like... <clears throat> God be showing motherfuckers who you are through the type of karma these motherfuckers get for coming for you. People become aware because God instantly uh, sit their ass down. God instantly, you know what I'm saying? Clairvoyant. Yeah. It's your gifts. It's the gifts for me. Okay. Motherfuckers don't like you because you see straight through they goofy ass. You see straight through the, the facade. You see straight through the bullshit. You see straight through the the uh the sketchy ass wording they use. Okay. The uh they motherfuckers try to be slick with their words. You you peep all that shit. It's so sad that a lot of it, that a lot of individuals like they they don't possess this gift of discernment. Okay, a lot of people be they get fooled, they get tricked, they get finessed because they just simply aren't aware. Okay, they say it's like the blind leading a blind bro, literally. Wow. Okay, let's uh clarify. January third is highly significant. Let's clarify some things with the uh, tarot deck. Clarify has been divinely ordered. What is this? Damn, the Knight of Swords, bro, the Knight of Swords and the Reverse. For someone here specific, is a false prophet that could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or or someone, bro. Just just someone that's false in nature. You, bro, I just said you be. Thank you, bro. You be sit like sit on certain missions, okay? Something it's some you was divinely ordered to this lifetime to expose all the fakes. This is why a lot of people don't like you because they so remember you from a past life, okay? And it's like people get uncomfortable in your presence, okay? Um, because you're it's like you're a whistleblower, okay? It's like you're you're so you're so uh it's like God used you to expose shit, bro. Okay, you have been, you, this is lying. This is unethical shit. Motherfuckers lying. Motherfuckers leading. It's like the blind leading the blind. Motherfuckers knowing they leading people to, to the pits of hell or just leading people down the wrong path. It's a lot of motherfuckers doing that shit. All for the love of money, if you will, or material gain. Some type of fight, like, you know, mater, material gain, bro, I'm getting. Okay. It's like motherfuckers doing shit for the wrong reasons. And motherfuckers don't like the fact that you 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 go by the divine the divine law. Okay, you go by divine law. You're doing shit as you should here. All right. Clarifying undefeated. Oh we. <laughs> Y'all look at this. King of Swords, the Queen of Swords, and the King of Wands, I mean right okay wow so for someone here i pick it up on a couple bro it's a false ass couple that's false prophets bro that that the it's a couple that work that's been attempted to work against you to try to defeat you in some type of way okay it's a karmic ass couple here that don't like the fact that you're truly in your calling and you it's like every it's like bro just your existence you is you're exposed to these individuals Okay, just by just by being you, just by being in your calling. I just see four four four. You being protected from a karmic couple that attempted to defeat you. Okay, 
a queen of swords to the king of wise energy. Okay, and I'm getting it too. Also, you coming together. You coming together with your true divine counterpart. And you guys really are going to... This is like a dynamic duo. You and this person is truly going to be undefeated together. Okay, it's a queen of swords coming together with a king of wise. Or y'all reverse it, take it where it resonates. Or this would be some type of partnership, bro. But like I said, everybody can't sit with you. Everybody can't eat with you, bro. It's so many people mad you rejected some type of friendship, bro. Bro, for someone here, this could be a couple that's poly that wanted you. Bro, I'm just channeling off these, this queen of swords to this king of wise. This could be like a couple that wanted you to be on some poly shit and you rejected their offer, okay? And they, you know, they, they, they started to attack you, okay? It's like these are these the whoever this karmic couple is, they fake as fuck, bro. They false. Okay. So let's clarify. They are they aware they royally fucked up. Let's clarify. They aware they royally fucked up. They aware they royally fucked up. That's too many, my baby. Let's clarify that. They aware. What's this? Yes, not the source. Ooh, baby, they aware they royally fucked up because they can't eat, they can't sleep. They got your ancestors all over their ass. They're mentally conflicted. They don't know what, what the fuck to do, okay? Because all the attacks they sent you out of jealousy has came back to bite them in the ass and they are, they, it's like they're, they're all over the place, bro. Okay, they, they don't, they don't know how to accept the fact this is the new norm for them, okay? This is, <laughs> motherfuckers, they can't accept the fact they wrote their own, that they caused their own demise by coming for you, these false motherfuckers, all right? Okay, um, let's get a few more from this deck, then we're going to get some final messages, y'all. Uh, I ain't gonna take that one. That one fell on the floor. Let's get some messages, spirit. Let's get some messages. Ancestors be. <laughs> Bro. They didn't know. When motherfuckers come for you, they're not just coming for you. They coming for the, for the whole family tree, the whole lineage. When the motherfucker come for you, now it's, it's like. It's like you have that gift where you awaken, you just like you awaken the dead. When someone cut for you or when you in some type of distress, your ancestors, they, they rise, bro. Okay. They literally, they spirit literally rise and, and like go, go to war. Okay. Go to war for, for you. This is what's happening right now. It's all out here. They are where they royally fucked up because you're, it's like for some of these individuals that's coming for you. Uh, where this leads to a past life, it's like your ancestors, it's like a bloodline beef I'm getting. Some type of bloodline beef. Okay. Let's get some more energy. Then we gonna get a final message, y'all. And I'll see y'all soon. Later today. I got another message I gotta drop anyway. Disturbing information. Yes. The community is going to be disturbed by the information that's coming out about these false prophets, okay? And like I said, it's so sad. It's like, because it's people that support these false prophets. It's people that listen that that listen to and hang on to everything they say, okay? And it's going to hurt these people when they realize they've been fake, they've been duped, okay? That this person is a fake, they've been finessed, they've been duped out their energy, their money, their resources, Okay, and that's why I said a lot of people are getting called out. It's a lot of people you uh, that you know you're gonna witness. Everyone is gonna witness being called out for their fraudulent activity. I'm getting final message here. Okay, heartache and loss. Yeah, material and spiritual prosperity for you, my baby, because you you've completed the mission. Okay, effortlessly, just by existing, you're exposing a lot of fraudulent shit. And a lot, like I said, bro, a lot of people are, it's like the truth hurts. That's what I'm getting, the truth hurts. And a lot of people is just, they're going to be very disheartened. They're going to be very hurt, okay? 
they're going to be in this energy. They're going to feel like they lost some shit because they let these inner energy vampires finesse them out their energy, their resources, out of their money, out of whatever, okay? So that's the fucking vibes. God has used you to expose the imposters, the false prophets, okay? And they're all going to fall and be exposed around the world because the chosen ones have a ride, okay? I love you guys. If you want to book a session or you simply want to donate to the channel, I'm going to leave that info in the description to the next video. Bye.